Reward pop-ups, automated features that remove features. Yeah. <laughs> uh, interface options, video options, audio options, interface options. Find mouse, I don't know what that means. Game options, map info delay, number of seconds before the map view tooltip appears. Okay. Um, I don't know how to turn on quick combat, so that sucks. Um, so I lost that settler, that's kind of depressing. Um, how do I repair? Oh, here we go. Fortify until healed. Perfect. Um, then I can get this other trireme to go out and explore the other side. So that'll be good. Mathematics is the gate and key to the sciences. Okay, so now I have mathematics. I think it looks like it would be like catapults or something. Catapults are really useful for attacking fortified locations like cities and stuff. Um, although I can't really do much right now. Demands whales? Hey, is Japanese? What the heck? Why is my city demanding whales? Ridiculous. Okay, um... I guess for a long time whales were used for like their blubber, for oils, for burning in lamps or something. I don't know. Kind of funny. Um, so, I don't know, I'm, kinda, I'm still kind of depressed over losing that settler. I wish he would have survived. But, I don't know. Um, wow. Trireme healed so fast. <laughs> and he moved so far. So he's got 10 out of 10. Yeah, okay, perfect. So is the English trying? Okay. If I had known that encampment was there, I wouldn't have brought my settler down there. I would have took him to this one first. But, like, I got all selfish. Or, not selfish. Greedy. I tried to take over those ruins and think I could build, but... Don't do that, man. Don't do it. <laughs> I should have just retreated as soon as I saw that there was a... Uh, Barbarian encampment right there. Um, yeah, so. I, I want a work boat from you so I can I think I can get fish fish a couple times and then I can get I think I probably need a work boat for that too, I don't know. Um, you, sir, are going to build a plantation when it's your turn again. <coughs> Stonehenge has been built away. Trespassing in Stockholm. Yeah, yeah, I don't care. It's just Stockholm. Well, Stockholm's in Scandinavia, right? What the heck? Why don't they like the Dutch? Okay, um... Yes, plantation. Perfect. Let me give me dyes. I think one of my cities is asking for dyes. I have no idea which one it is, though, or how to look it up, so... Um, no idea. So my, my cities are expanding too fast, like, population-wise, so my happiness is going down, down, down. Um, well, did I explore everything that I could over here? That's a little ridiculous. Alright, we'll explore down here, I guess. Um, so... Oh yeah, you're under attack by the barbarians. So I'm gonna trespass the soul for now. Genoa? Stupid city-states. Should have never put you guys in. I'm gonna be brooding over that for a while, I think. I think I think the city-states are just kind of like a... In, in my opinion, they're kind of like a bad game mechanic, so... I think it's kind of... I think it's better to have more civilizations, but... Three things are to be looked to in a building. That it stand on the right spot, that it be securely founded, that it be successfully executed. Um, so... I think it's better to play against multiple civilizations rather than all these city-states. I shouldn't... I shouldn't have put in so many. It's ridiculous how many city-states there are. That's my own fault. I don't know. I should have had more foresight, I guess. 
So I think this guy, I think I can run him around down here, and then I can like skirt across this landmass down here. I don't know if I can go across the South Pole or not, but uh, that'd be nice if I could. Um, I am the Vikings after all, I should be the ones to discover the, <laughs> the new worlds and stuff, so. Um, Vikings, brave, they don't care about falling off the edge of the earth. <laughs> Um, so what am I doing? Currency? That'd be nice. Let's see. Machu Picchu? Oh yeah, Machu Picchu is nice. I want that. National Treasury, Market, and Mint. Okay. Wow, Genoa's been under attack a lot too. That's kind of strange. Huh. Okay. Um, so as you can see, like, my world's pretty well populated, so I picked a good number of stuff. I think I just maxed everything out, so... So that means that uh, eventually, as people start getting closer and closer to each other, there's gonna be a lot of conflict, and I kinda like that in Civilization, when there's a lot of stuff going on. Because if it's just, like, you playing turn after turn, like I'm doing now, it kinda, like, takes a long time. <laughs> And, and it's kind of long and boring, and I don't know, it's kind of hard to even talk about stuff, so. Uh, choose production. Okay, so you built uh, the, the circus, so my people are somewhat happy. Um, so let's go ahead and build um, library? I, I need library for more science. Um, okay, so... Oh, if you clear um, jungles or forests, it'll give you production towards whatever you're building, so that's kind of nice. I, wonder if, I think I can skirt along down there across the South Pole and maybe circumnavigate the world. That'd be awesome. Um, whether it gives you a bonus or not, I don't know. Um, oh, the Greeks. Hi, the kid. Alexandro say me. He also on an acton. Can you form yourself much? <laughs> Son of kings and the grandson of gods. All right. Um, just for being a jerk, nice. I'm going to demand that you give me this. Okay, fine. Do that way, jerk. Who's up, horse? Um, yes, yeah, so that guy is kind of a. Uh, Alexander the Great. Ooh. <laughs> All right. Um, <clears throat> Lord. I think my name is cooler, because, what am I, Harold Bluetooth? I mean, come on, Bluetooth? That's so awesome, it's like, I don't even know, you gotta like, Bluetooth is like that uh, wireless technology, so, yeah, the, I'm wireless before you guys even have wires, so, there, jerks. Alright, fine. Why? Which one do I want? Give you open borders. Just don't come bringing your uh, haughtiness over to my land. <laughs> I heard that like... Have, have you guys seen uh, the movie Alexander? I think? With uh, Colin Farrell? Oh, is it Colin Farrell? Oh, I don't know. Uh, maybe Orlando Bloom? No. Who's in Troy? I don't even know. But... Um, yeah, like, Alexander was, like, pretty homosexual in that movie, as far as I remember, so it's kind of awkward. So, since he wants open borders with me, I, I gotta make sure I watch the the rear section of my civilization. Instrumental or mechanical science is the noblest, and above all the others, the most useful. The voice of the people is the voice of Sweet. God. Oh, I got engineering for the research agreement. So I guess you only get one technology for the research agreement, but uh, it costs 300 and you don't have to waste your science points on it, so I think it's a big... Uh, it's a very useful investment if you have the money and you can afford it. I, I have tons of money, so I can afford it. So. Open Borders is done. Okay. Did you build Trireme? Let's build, um... I like the pyramids. I can build, uh, 
worker improvements a lot faster, so I'll go for that. I don't need dyes again, so I'm going to go ahead and go for these deer and set up a... Was it a hunting post or a trapping post or something like that? Oh, I have to choose production. Let's see. Aqueduct. 40% food is carried over for the next new citizen. Okay, sweet. Um, monument is bonus culture. Um, do I need this to make a harbor? Oh, I don't have I don't have the technology for harbor. We need like compass or something. Um, granary. Each wheat, banana, and deer produces extra food. I only have one deer, so that's probably not too worth it at the moment. We'll go for Lighthouse for now, because he's got a lot of bonus elite uh, C stuff. Um, oh yeah, I'm going around this way. So, I got kind of cut off. You can't skirt across the South Pole, apparently, so it kind of sucks. So I have this extra trireme for nothing, unless there's something up here. Oh, no. Yep. <laughs> okay, so I fail at scouting. Uh, fail at exploring. Christopher Columbus would be ashamed. Um, well, you know, us Chris's, we got to stick together, because there's only like 4.7 billion of us in the world. Um, so if your name is Chris, shout out to you, because that's my name as well. Um, okay, so what is it? Oh, construct a camp. So plus one production, which is which is fine. That'll help me build stuff. So these these English man, they're they're like bubonic plague, just like spreading all over the place. Coli virus, bacteria, multiplying and dividing. Um. Okay. So Brussels. Why do all the city states want cotton? That's kind of weird. <clears throat> um, oh, I have cotton too, so that's... Oh no, they have cotton. Yeah, okay. That makes sense. Trade route established. Oh, Copenhagen and Aarhus, okay. Um, why is your vision sucking so bad? What the heck's the deal here? Oh, oh. <laughs> I thought it was the trireme, but it's the scout. What am I thinking? Okay. Wow. <clears throat> Gotta pay attention to those little shield symbols, because it'll tell you what, what the unit is. So I, I thought that was a scout, or I thought it was the trireme, but it was actually the scout, so that was pretty stupid. So hopefully all this exploring that I'm doing is living up to the Viking's name. Um, I haven't been doing much plundering and pillaging yet, because there isn't really a unit that does that. Um, which is kind of a shame. <laughs> um, so who's up here? Spanish, no. Cyan? Raul Paul Kunram Kam Hang, Gasat Hang Siam, Nap Pinky at the Ying. Who the heck is Cyan? Like, seriously. I have no idea where Siam is. Is it like. My guess is. East? Like. In the Far East somewhere, but... <laughs> Siam... Oh, who are those weeds? <laughs> um, yeah, I think they're in the Far East somewhere, but as far as where, I'm not sure, but whatever. Um, so, I have no idea how long I've been playing. I've just been, like, talking and doing some turns and whatnot. Um... So you, I think you're pretty much done with what supposed to do up there. Let's can't really build a farm. What, what can you do over here? So I'll have to find out next turn. Am I talking to these inanimate machine things now? What the heck? I'm losing my mind to Civilization 5. Okay, um... 50 gold? Oh, okay. Nice. Ooh, there's gold back here. Nice. <laughs> Um, so my scout has some pretty crappy vision, <coughs> but I guess that's to be expected when you're walking on land. Come on, kill him!
Nice. Alright, choose production. Lighthouse. Plus one food on ocean tiles. Oh, whoops. Oh no. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So I have a wood boat, that's right. Alright, trading home. I think a farm is probably a good idea for this. You, sir. Can't really do anything right now. Oh, fish, that's right. Okay. So you are going to become a fishing boat. Yes. Alright. So. Yeah, that's going to give me a lot of fruit there. Perfect. <coughs> Alright, so. This guy is scouting around, sees absolutely nothing. So I'm going to send him up here to go harass the Greeks. Um, so I think I'm probably going to call it quits at the end of this turn. And um, yeah, let me know what you think of the new microphone. Uh, make sure you leave comments and subscribe if you haven't, because uh, the more subscribers, the more, I don't know, it's just good for me. <laughs> um, so I'll just... Catch you guys next time. Um, keep playing Civilization 5, and if you can't, well, sorry. <laughs>